Hello, welcome to Anatomy 101, Human Anatomy and Physiology with me, your instructor, Cynthia Sanchez. To begin, let's go to Canvas. In your web browser, enter msjc.instructure.com. This brings us to the MSJC portal. Enter your username and password and click Login. Once you have logged in, look for the section that you are enrolled in and click to open. Upon opening this course, the home page will be identical to the modules page. The reason for this is this is the best way to navigate the course. This course has a getting started module, which includes a welcome message from me and a copy of the video you are watching now. There is a link to the course calendar, a link to the free OER textbook. When clicking on this link, make sure to click on this one as well. That will bring you to our Anatomy and Physiology online free textbook. There is also an Anatomy 101 laboratory manual. However, keep in mind that this version of the manual was designed for an in-house, in-person laboratory. Required assignments from the laboratory manual have been converted to an electronic version for online courses. So keep in mind that the assessments in the laboratory manual may differ from their online version. Returning to modules, possibly most importantly, there is a PDF download of the syllabus at this link here. In addition, information of the syllabus can be found on the syllabus page. Let's go there now. One of the most important things you might need is information on office hours. The best way to reach me is via email at csanchez at msjc.edu. Office hours are held in the format of a question and answer session and attendance is not required. Office hours will be held Thursdays from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. via Zoom or you can request a private Zoom meeting appointment upon request. To do so, please email your request to csanchez at msjc.edu and please include dates and times that you can be available. Let's take a look at the breakdown of our coursework. This course has a lecture component and a laboratory component. The lecture assignments will include 16 discussion questions, 16 crossword puzzles, 11 chapter exams, three lecture quizzes, and one online lecture final exam. The laboratory assignments include nine lab quizzes, three study guide uploads, five worksheets, 12 workbook assignments, nine exit quizzes, and three practical exams. The entire course is worth 1,000 possible points. We use a standard grading scale. Scrolling down further, you can see another instance of our course schedule. Let's return to modules. Scrolling down, you can see that each week is built as a separate module. All assignments for that week will be due on that Sunday by 11.59 p.m. Let me walk you through our week one module. For week one, we will go over chapter one, an introduction to the human body. Let's click on the first link to get started. Here, you will see the chapter objectives along with links, which will open up the textbook for you to complete your reading. When you are done, click Next. Next, you will see the Chapter 1 PowerPoint or Study Guide. This is the same study guide or PowerPoint that you should use to complete your crossword puzzles. PowerPoints can be viewed online as so or downloaded by this link here. Clicking on Next brings you to the Chapter 1 videos. These videos were created by me specifically for this course and are highly recommended. After viewing the videos, click Next. This brings us to our first assignment. I'm going to hit Student View here so that my screen will look a lot like yours will. Here, I can see Chapter 1 exam, which is due Sunday by 11.59 p.m. There are 10 points and 20 questions. There is no time limit, and there are unlimited temps allowed up until the date and time that it is due. Once you have submitted an answer to a question, you will not be able to go back and change your answers. Therefore, be confident of each answer before submitting. 
When you are ready, click Take the Quiz. Answer each of the questions and click on Next. When you are done with all questions, click Submit Quiz. Now hit Next. Next, you will use that Chapter 1 PowerPoint to find the answers to your crossword puzzle. I'm going to click on Take the Quiz. Under Instructions, you can see a link that you should copy and paste into your web browser. Click on each of the numbers and you will enter your answers. When you have completed all of the answers, you will see a star like so. Then, on the drop down menu, choose this page. Then, go to Print. Under Print Preview, under Destination, open the drop down menu and choose Save as PDF. Then, we'll save this in a location that you'll be able to find it later. Let's go back to our assignment and now, we will upload our completed PDF crossword file into Canvas. We'll hit Choose File, upload the file, and once it has been successfully uploaded, hit Submit Quiz. Great! Clicking on Next brings us to our Week 1 discussion question. Each of the discussion questions are similar. For each discussion question, you will choose any one of the questions listed. Then you will answer the question fully and completely in 250 words or more. It is suggested that once you figure out which question you would like to address, to copy and paste this into your answer. Click on Reply, paste the question, and type your answer. When you are done, click on Post Reply. Let's click on Next. Now we see that we're at the lab portion of our Week 1 module. This will include objectives, lab readings, a PowerPoint, laboratory videos, created by me, especially for this course, and we'll click Next. Here we see our first laboratory assignment for Week 1. Scrolling down to the bottom of the page, you'll click on Take the Quiz. For questions that look like this, you will have a drop-down menu. Once you have completed all of the questions, hit Submit Quiz. Let's click on Next. Here, we see another worksheet assignment. Scrolling down to the bottom allows you to click on Take the Quiz. Once you have completed each of the questions, hit Submit Quiz. Let's hit Next. Now we can see we've completed Week 1, and we're on to Chapter 2, and we're on to Week 2. Let's go back to our modules. Each of the weekly modules is very similar. Finals week for this course is Monday, December 12th, through Friday, December 16th. On this final week, the only thing you will have due is a cumulative lecture final exam worth 45 points. Thank you for watching, and I hope this gives you a great start to our course. I look forward to working with you to reach your educational goals. Thank you for watching.